Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Regarding the first flight of this Mark 1A, we have already reported a month back. Now HL has confirmed the same in its financial report for the year 2021-22. As per the report, 83 LCA Mark 1A program attained a major milestone with the first flight of the prototype held on 20th May 2022. As per contract signed between HL and Indian Air Force during Aero India 2021 in February, HL needs to deliver first three aircraft in 2024 and 16 aircraft per year for subsequent five years which goes on till March 2030. Besides this, HL has also produced 34 aircrafts that includes LCA Tejas, Donier Do 228, ALH Dhruv and Light Combat Helicopter LCH. This is quite a good development as Stages Mark 1A delivery is slated to commence from 2024 onwards. However, the fighter jet is already roaring high in the sky. It's also worth noting that production and delivery of 32 Tejas Mark 1, which includes 16 Tejas of initial operational clearance and 16 Tejas of final operational clearance is complete. What remains from initial order is 8 LCA trainer jets. HL has plans to deliver four of them this financial year and remaining four next financial year. LCA Tejas numbered SP25 is being used as a testbed for Tejas Mark 1A. The Mark 1A will be upgraded version of the FOC configuration with 80% of detail components being the same. The Mark 1A will have 43 improvements over Mark 1 version. At present, the aircraft is equipped with 344 system out of which 210 are indigenous and 134 are imported. However, Mark 1A will have less imported system reduced to just 80. Many LRUs that is line replaceable units will be repositioned and new LRUs are to be inducted. This is done keeping in mind the maintainability easiness. Indian Air Force wants airframe panels that can be replaced without taking too much time and these will be supplied to Indian Air Force with quick release fasteners. The major highlights of Mark 1A version is going to be indigenous Uttam AEC radar and electronic warfare suite that includes a jammer, the combined integrator and transponder CIT and IFF plus system, a digital map generator indigenous beyond visual range missile Astra Mark 1 and MBDS advanced short range air to air missile ASR AAM. The development trials of both Astra Mark 1 and ASR AAM is planned to be complete before the delivery of this Mark 1A starts. The carriage as well as the captive trials of both missiles are complete and next set of user trials and developmental trials are expected soon. Tejas has already been integrated with Israel's IWER and Python 5 missiles. IWER missile is a long range air to missile having an operational range of up to 100 km with a maximum speed of Mach 4 and two way data link. The Python 5 is the newest member of Israeli Python family of short range air to air missiles. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.